Welcome to WatchGuard's Daily Security Byte. I'm Corey Nockreiner. Today's story is HTTP is not secure and semantic certificates suck. Today's video actually combines two stories that both involve Google. Google is using its Chrome browser to try to promote HTTP security, specifically by pushing HTTPS for every website on the internet. While overall this is generally a good thing, some people also think it might give Google too much control into who can be a certificate authority. Anyways, both of these stories involve some updates that are coming to Chrome. One update is coming around June, June 8th, I think, and the other update is coming right before July. Let's start with the later update, the one right before July. Google has warned the world that Chrome will no longer consider HTTP sites secure. Any site you go to that only offers HTTP will be listed as not secure in the Chrome browser come this uh, July date for I think Chrome Update 68 is the specific one. Now this is Google's way of kind of shaming the industry and forcing their sites to update to HTTPS. In general, it's probably good for all sites to support HTTPS just for privacy and security. However, some might argue that Google's being too forceful in calling a HTTP site not secure. For instance, you might have a very basic non-dynamic site that only uses HTTP. There's really not much there that you can post or that can give away who you are. And in some cases, there may be no reason for it to be HTTPS. Nonetheless, I personally think there's nothing wrong with all sites being HTTPS, so I'm not too against this. However, the second issue, which will actually happen earlier, sometime in June, I believe, is Google release a version of Chrome that no longer considers semantic issued certificates, TLS and SSL certificates, secure. It will no longer accept them for HTTPS sites as a secure uh, certificate. This really actually kills Symantec's ability to be a certificate authority. Now, the reason Google's doing this is over time, uh, Symantec's made mistakes and issued uh, certificates badly. They've given domain certificates to people that shouldn't have them. So some might argue that this is justifiable. Symantec hasn't been a good CA or certificate authority lately. However, others might argue it gives Google one entity to too much power into deciding who can and can't be a certificate authority. Now how much power this really is is still kind of an unknown. There are other browsers out there, Safari, Internet Explorer, Edge, Firefox, and so on. Those browsers have a different list of certificate authorities that they allow or don't allow. So it will be interesting to see how they react to Google removing Semantic. In either case, it really is kind of interesting. And the relevance to you is, Many, many sites out there actually use Semantic as a certificate authority. So there's not a huge practical takeaway here. It's just some news you should know about that in June, any site with a Semantic certificate may not work as well in Chrome. Anyways, just thought it was interesting Chrome-related news, ways that they're trying to enforce stronger and more secure web connections, but they're also making waves in the industry that some think are, are good and bad. That's it for today's news. Thank you for watching. Oh, 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 oh,